YouTube, man, what's good, man? You feel me? It's your boy, Nana the Soul, man. I'm back with another video, bro. Bros, you feel me? Bros, day 72, man. Let's go, bros. This journey's amazing, dog. Like, it's the best journey you can ever be on as a man, y'all. Hold your see, brothers. You feel me? Your boy's finna head to school. But I was like, bro, let me get this banger in real quick, man. I can't go a day without serving my purpose. You feel me? Now, what, what I'm about to talk to, what I'm about to talk about today is about to get not really deep, but it's going to be a short video. You feel me? But I'm going to make another video today. You feel me? Things that will happen to you when you start to embark on semen retention. These are some of the things that's going to happen to you, man. Real talk, bros. Hold your seat, man. Don't let these urges get to y'all, bro. Let's keep elevating. Let's keep being kings. Let's keep taking our power back. Physically, mentally, spiritually, I have changed, bro. I'm not the same dude. You feel me? I'm more aligned with God, bro. Every morning I wake up, I pray. I hope y'all are doing the same thing. I pray. I meditate. I get into the word. You feel me? I take me my cold showers. I work out. I'm doing things most men are not doing, bro. You feel me? Y'all need to start to retain, dog. It's going to change your life, bro. It's going to change your life, bros. You feel me? You're going to change, bro. <laughs> like, it, it's amazing, man. You feel me? I'm keeping it going. It's the longest streak I've ever been on. 72 days, man. It's just getting started. The fun is about to start, bro. You feel me? Shout out to all of y'all retaining, too, bro. Shout out to all of y'all subscribing to my channel. Y'all mean so much to me, bro. You feel me? Now, let's get into things that's going to happen to you when you embark on semen retention. The first thing that's going to happen to you is you're going to be an alpha male, bro. You are going to be purpose-driven. You as a man, that is why God brought you down here, to be purpose-driven. Everybody was sent down here for a purpose. But as a man, that should be your main focus, purpose. Your main focus should not be the V-Box. Your main focus should not be females. Your main focus should not be chasing them. Instead, you should be focusing on God. You should be focusing on your purpose. What, what, what is keeping you motivated? What is keeping you driven, bro? Every day you wake up in the morning, what is the first thing you do? As a man, you should be doing these righteous things, bro. Real talk. If you're a man of God, you know what I'm talking about. Y'all brothers who are serving God. Y'all brothers who are living a righteous lifestyle. You know what I'm talking about. You're more purpose driven. You want to work on your purpose. You want to work on yourself. You're more an alpha male. I don't really use those terms, but I'm just using it today just for, for, just for the sake of it. Just for the sake of the video. You're going to become an alpha male. You're going to become a man who is purpose driven. A man of power. A man who has status. A man who's a leader, bro. All that status, money, looks. I'm not into the red pill. You feel me? I follow God. This is where I get my knowledge from. You feel me? You're going to be a leader. As soon as you find your purpose as a man, you will be a leader. Seema retention will help you and lead you to God. So that will lead you to your purpose, your God-given purpose, y'all. I'm telling y'all, when you're releasing all the time, you're disconnected from the source, which is God. You're disconnected from the most high God, bro. You're all over the place. You're, you're living in your lowest chakras. You're living in your lowest vibration. You're living in the flesh. Real talk, bros. You got to live in the spirit out here, man. Because there's a lot of worldly things going on. People indulging into the flesh every single day. Nobody's worried about their purpose. Nobody's worried about God. People are not trying to live righteous. They're still doing these unrighteous things every single day, bros. You got to stand out. When you hold your seed, you're standing out automatically. Because you are holding the power that God wanted you to hold as a man in the first place, bros. You feel me? That's one on my list, bro. I'm not really going to make a list. I'm just going to talk about the things, bro. You feel me? Two is it's better connection with better connections with God, bro. You wake up in the morning, you have a sense of urgency. You have a sense of just purpose. You're, you're motivated to, to work out, to pray, to meditate. You're, you're, you're driven, bro. There's, there's a higher power, which is God, pushing you to do these righteous things. At first, when you relapse all the time, you feel me? You don't want to do nothing because you don't have the energy. You don't have that spirit of God within you because you are not holding your seed. Your seed is that information. Your seed is that spirit of God, bro. So when you're releasing it all the time, you're living in the lowest state as a man, bro. That's why you feel lazy. You feel tired. You got headaches, depression, anxiety. You're not confident. You don't want to get out and go get these gains. You don't want to work on yourself, bro. You don't want to improve. You don't want to go out and go get money. 
You don't want to work on yourself. You don't want to work on your purpose. You're not driven. You're not masculine. I'm telling y'all what this seed is going to do to you, man. When you start to embark on this journey, your life will change, dog. And I got a video dropping how my life changed on semen retention. It's going to be a banger. You feel me? All my videos are starting to become better because I'm more aligned with myself and who I am. I know who I am, bro. I know who God called me to be. So there's no more be like stalling, bro. Like I'm here to do what I'm here to do. You feel me? Like your boy has changed, bro. I know y'all look at me like, bro, I'm proud of you. I'm proud of y'all too, man. I'm proud of y'all too. We all came a long way. God made this happen, bro. Real talk. You feel me? But that's too, bro. You're going to connect with God, man. Most people are not out here connecting with God. Most people are out here trying to live in the flesh. All they do, the first thing they do when they wake up is get on that phone, start to scroll on Instagram. You feel me? Go on the site. Come on, bros. You're not a little boy no more, man. Why are you still going on those demonic sites? You feel me? You're not a little boy, man. Even these little boys need to stop doing that. All men, even little kid boys, need to stop releasing their seed. That's why I make my videos. These videos are going to touch a lot of people. Cosima retention is going to start to get out there, bro. And my channel is going to blow because of that. Because I'm, sp I'm spreading the message early, bro. I'm telling y'all, bros, man. This, this journey is, is, is righteous. There's no way you can't be righteous when you hold your seed. And if you decide to live unrighteous when you're holding your seed, you're not going to reap the, the, the real benefits. You're not going to reap the, that, that potent energy. You're not going to really get it. You feel me? Because you're still indulging into the world. You're still doing things of this world. You're probably smoking still a lot. You're probably drinking. You feel me? You're probably edging. Come on, bros. You're holding your seed. You should be pure and clean, bros. You feel me? These things will happen to you on semen retention, man. As soon as you hop on this journey, connection with God, purpose-driven, alpha male, you feel me? That's two. Three, better skin. You feel me? You gonna glow. You gonna glow, bro. You gonna have better interactions with females. You gonna have better interactions with men. You are going to have all of these things I'm mentioning, bro. The glow, confidence, you feel me? Um, no anxiety, no depression. Bro, you gonna be a man, bro. People will talk to you and they just, just gonna feel it from your voice. You, go, you just gonna feel it, bro. These pheromones are not a joke. That spirit of God within you is not a joke. It's big, bro. It's a big spirit you have cultivated. It's a big energy that you have cultivated. I got some hair in my mouth. Come on, bro. Bro. All right, there we go, bros. You feel me? Got hair in my mouth, bro. Stop playing, bro. But you, bro, you gonna you gonna you gonna have the spirit of just God within you, bro. People gonna be shook. You get around people, they shook by your spirit, bro. Because you have a huge spirit. Your spirit is of God. Your spirit is so righteous. And these demons that are in people, people who are still of the world, they're gonna be shook by you. Intimidation. You feel me? They don't want to look at you in the eyes. Even if they do look at you in the eyes, they're gonna look right down. They're gonna look away quick. Because they know you can see through them. When you hold your seed, you have the spirit of God. You feel me? You're a righteous man, a righteous woman. You're going to see through people. You're going to see through what they want to do. You're going to see through all their illusions. Real talk. You're going to see through every single person you come across when you hold this power because you have the spirit of God within you. You are basically judging people, bro. You're basically judging people when you hold your seed because you have that spirit of God within you. You're looking at people. You feel me? You're seeing what they are, what they do. You just read the spirit, but you read it. You, you feel how you, you, you start to feel energies more. You start to fill people's spirit out. That's why you don't you don't go off of looks. You feel me? When you hold your seed, you don't look at females as sex objects no more. You, you don't. You don't. You're going to connect with them better, bro. You feel me? You're going to connect with them, bro. Like, you, you too, I talk to females and I like, just, just, bro, it's like, it's normal, bro. Like, no, I'm just not, I don't have that anxiety no more. I'm confident. I look at them in the eyes. You feel me? We be having a nice interaction, nice male to female interaction, masculine to feminine interaction. You feel me? When you're always in your head relapsing, you can't have that connection because you don't have the masculine energy. So basically, she has to play both sides, bro. Because you are playing too much in your feminine. So she's probably going to play more into her masculine side than you, bro. That's why the seed is important. It keeps you in your masculine frame. It keeps you as a masculine man. The seed is no joke. You need your seed, bro. I'm not going to sit here and tell you all you, you, you don't need. You need your seed, bro. Without it, you're not a man. <laughs> what do you think 
you're made of as a man. Your seed. This is your beauty. This is your life. So you got to hold it, dog. You got to hold on for dear life. Real talk, bros. Stop playing out here, man. Stop playing, bro. You feel me? Bruh, better skin. You going to glow. Y'all see the glow. You feel me? Y'all see the glow, man. No sunlight. We don't need the sunlight. We don't need so no cream. We need light, pure natural light. You feel me? Just, just, just. It's, it's literally about to rain right now, and I'm glowing. I'm, I'm not. I'm literally glowing, bro. You know why? Because I'm not releasing the natural energy I have within me. I'm not releasing this energy. You feel me? This energy has nutrients that your body needs to 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 replenish itself, to keep it to keep it going. This is a vessel, bro. You got to take care of your vessel. You feel me? So when you hold your seed, the nutrients is replenishing your body. Those nutrients are going to places in your body that, that you need, bro. Like your nails. It's going to start to grow. You feel me? Your hair, your beard, your skin, bro. Real talk, bros. You're going to glow on semen retention like crazy. I know 90 days, that's when you're going to get the times to glow. Every single day, you're going to glow. Every single day. Just know that, fellas. You are going to glow, bro. As soon as you embark on semen retention because that energy you're holding it now you're not depleting it bro you're actually holding it within you bro that's that that's that force that life force man you feel me real talk bro what y'all see brothers stop relapsing bro it's not worth it at all bros you feel me hey bro connections with females bro in a relationship it's gonna be way better in your relationships you're going, you're going to be treating these females like they're your best friend, bro, even though you're in a relationship. Real talk. Y'all going to be connecting so much, bro. You're not in your head no more. That seed, when you release it, you're in your head. Because now you're looking at that female as a sex object. This is why porn was created. They want you to look at these females like just, just, just dogs. You feel me? Just, just, just look at them and just want to go crazy. No. This is not how God wanted it to be. He wants you to connect with females, bro. Men and females were always meant to connect. We were always meant to just have that nice masculine and feminine energy just connecting, bro. Just, it's so beautiful, bro. How when you hold your seed, you actually see the beauty of life. You see the beauty of these females. They're queens, bro. You see other men, you see them as kings, bro. Real talk, bro. Now, most females, obviously, they don't deserve your energy. They don't deserve your time because they're still of the world. Some men don't deserve your energy, don't deserve your time because they're still of this world. You have to have the spirit of discernment, bro, to, to be able to see who's right for you on this journey. Because this journey is beautiful. And I'm never going back to my old ways. Never. You feel me? Beautiful journey, bros. Hold your seed, man. You feel me? Better gains in the gym, bro. You're going to hit that gym. You're going to be feeling energized, bros. You feel me? Mental clarity, man. That wisdom. You're going to be waking up with creativity, bro. You're going to be waking up with creative ideas. You're going to be starting to do things you never did before, bros. Where do you think this is coming from? Your seed. Your seed is your creative energy, bro. It, it is, dog. So you can't be releasing it. Because when you do, you're not creative no more. Your creative power, your creative energy is gone, bros. It's gone, bros. <laughs> bros, it's gone. That, that, that thick hair you want, that, that regrowth, you don't want no patches in your beard. You want that masculine face, that masculine structure. You feel me? You want that, you want that nice little, that, 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 that neck showing. You feel me? That masculine look. Bro, hold your seat. Most men out here, they be talking like feminine females, bro. You hear no type of voice, no type of bass in their voice. You know why? Because they're busting gallons. Your seed is your testosterone, dog. Oh, it makes you a man. What don't y'all get? So if you release it, you're losing that manhood. You feel me? You're losing a part of yourself. This is why your voice sounds so squeaky. Most men who relapse, they got this squeaky voice. It, their voice does not sound as good as a man retaining that masculine presence, that masculine essence. You feel me? It, I'm not saying your voice is going to be out, out the world. Like it's going to be so deep. No. It's just going to enhance. You're going to have a masculine tone to it. When you talk, people want to listen. Because you have power now. You have energy. Energy is the most important thing on this planet, bro. Nothing else. None of, none of the looks. Your looks don't matter. None of that. Energy. You feel me? Energy. 
Now, I'm not telling you to go to, to just not take care of your vessel. No, take care of your physical vessel. You feel me? But it's not the most important. Your spirit, you feel me? Your energy, that's the most important. They will never tell you this, though. That's why they got y'all doing so much unrighteous things, bro. They want to corrupt your spirit. Real talk. They literally want to corrupt your spirit. I'm telling y'all, man, that spirit, they want to attack it. That's why they got y'all watching porn. All these demonic sites, bro. You feel me? But yeah, man, like, comment, share, and subscribe, man. It's your boy, Nana the Soul. I hope y'all enjoying this video. And I'm out.